Hey traders, John Howell here. Now, I'm really excited right now. I've got some, what I'm going to share with you right now, guys, I believe there's going to be an incredible opportunity that's coming probably this week, and that's why I'm really excited. Right now, it's Sunday morning for me, and I'm getting ready for some really good opportunities. So guys, looking at all the stock market and the indices and so on and so forth, there's, there's some really incredible opportunities for us to for us to do do really well this week. And I want to share with you what I'm seeing right now and why I believe there's some incredible opportunities for us. Let's get straight into it. Don't place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video because there is no guarantees of making a profit in the market. It takes you a long time to become a good trader. So this video here is just to educate you to become a much better trader. Alrighty, traders, see that trading course on the screen right now? Um, I used to I, I'm giving you I'm giving I've been giving away free membership access to uh to that. I'm actually about to take I'm about to take that free access down and start to charge for it again so if you want to get access to it guys make sure you have access to that first thing in the description i'm giving you a free membership access to that um to to to, to that trading course so um now let's actually get straight into the actual markets itself um i'm i've been looking i've been looking at the actual markets itself right now right i've been looking at the stock market i mean like what's really going on here right now because as a trader yourself, okay, there's two different types of approaches. You there's two different types of things we need to look at, right? And um, and again, guys, you you, you wait to see, especially when I when I, when I show you something. I'm gonna <laughs> I can't talk right now. I'm try, I'm so excited. Anyway, um, um, the thing that I am looking at right now, and the one that, that that I'm showing you right now, is indeed the the really big thing that I'm noticing is that I'm I'm, I'm seeing that. Um, that there's uh, on the actual, even on st the stocks and also the indices here, okay? So looking at the indices right now, we see on the Russell, not so much on the Russell, okay? So the Russell, the Russell is, is sort of, it's, it's coming back down to this level here of support, okay? So we have probably this level right here on the Russell, on the daily chart. So if I go to, if I go to my hourly charts on the Russell, we could possibly be, we could possibly see the Russell, come back down to this level through here um this was actually a beautiful trade that i actually um that i actually took on the russell did i take it um maybe one of my clients did anyway so i'm um, so looking at that through there but he check this out okay check this out now looking at the there's looking at the shorter time frame charts on some of these other indices we <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know how to say this, guys. But it's like this could get really ugly, but then it could be really good, right? It's like, and so let, let me show you this here. So looking at the Nasdaq chart, now we know the Nasdaq 100 is what is very, very, very overextended, and we know that we're expecting a good pullback. This is probably likely to happen this week. And it could get ugly really quickly. Now, remember, guys, remember the big thing about when the market goes down, we can actually start to elaborate, elaborate, eliminate what happened. One day can take away many days in the past, right? So if I go to the daily charts here and I look at the XJO, the, the Australian stock market, for you guys that follow the Australian stock market, like I do, because for me personally, guys, my personal trading, right? My personal trading. And again, guys, that first thing in the description, when you click on that, the first video I'm going to teach you, I'm going to teach you my trading system, and I use this trading system on all the on all the markets. Okay, so I look at the Australian market, I look at the, the uh, forex and futures markets as well, and also the U.S. stock market. So I'm keeping an eye on all the markets here. So look 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 what actually happened on the Australian stock market. Like man, this thing just completely fell off a cliff. Now look at this here, one two days on the Australian stock market eliminated what one two three four five six seven days. Well, basically three days, right? Three days eliminated seven days up. That's how fast things can move move for you and move and move against you, right? But or move against move against the market. But that's actually not a bad thing, right? Because what we can short it, we can buy put options, we can short the futures. You know, we can do some stuff like that, right? We can get some really good opportunities. So he's really gets he gets he's where he gets really excited. Um, is it Monday today? Is the market open? Damn, it's Sunday. Okay, cool. Let's get ready for let's, let's get ready for a good week. Okay, so if we go have a look at the hourly charts, right? Look at this here. This is the Australian stock market falling off a cliff. Um, I had no trades anyway. Oh, anyway, I'll, I'll get to that in just a minute. But if we look at the Nasdaq, look what's happened with the Nasdaq, right? We know the Nasdaq on the daily chart is what it is overextended, right? We know it's overextended, but look what's happening here now on the Nasdaq chart. We are really, 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 really starting to uh, look at this here. 
right? We're starting to what? We're starting to really peter out. Peter out. We're, guys, how do you, firstly, how do you actually spell that? Put it in the chat box below. Peter. Peter out. And for, and secondly, where the hell did that actually come from? Where does where did P, it starts to peter out? Like that's the, where did that, where did that phrase actually come from? <laughs> it's like peter out. Anyway, look at this here, guys. For so long, we've actually had a strong upward trend. Look at this here, high, significant lower high. We start to break down here. Guess what's coming, guys? At least a movement back down towards this level here. Now I'm looking at the futures chart. I'm looking at the Nasdaq futures chart here, not the Nasdaq 100 composite, composite or the Nasdaq 100 cash chart. Okay, I'm looking at the futures chart here and what's actually happened to futures here. So this is the futures here, right? Futures could be getting down, down, down. The prices are down, right? We could be really starting to see some movement on the downside. So here's the really interesting thing that I'm seeing here when it comes to the NASDAQ, right? We're seeing that and we could be getting ready for a movement back down to this level here, 14,300. Now, if I go to my daily charts now and let's actually bring on some good old funky donkey trend lines. Let's bring on, let's bring on the hooray. <laughs> the hooray. There you go. Hooray. Right. If we do do that, let's actually bring this down to here. There you go. Right. So I'm looking at the hooray. <laughs> the hooray. The array. Look at that there. Big double top. Rejection. The big hooray. Um, so the big hooray array. It's I'm talking about this one here, guys, by the way. See it says uh it's like See, it says Ray. I'm calling it Hooray. Um, if you didn't, if you guys didn't get the joke. <laughs> so, anyway, so look at the Hooray. Is that's that's that level there for that that level there. So if we are going to get a pullback to something, we're probably only going to get a pullback to here, right? So, but still, when we're saying only a pullback to there, that's still what? That's still a good ten or so percent, maybe a bit more on, on the actual charts there. So if we go look at the hourly charts now, and we look at the Hooray, right? Where's the hooray coming to it? <laughs> the hooray, there you go, guys. The hooray. Um, um, and I'm also going to share with you one stock, guys. What? I've got a few stocks I want to share with you as well, too, right? So anyway, so when we actually break down, the hooray comes into where? Where's the hooray coming to it? The hooray comes into it here, right? So we could be getting a pullback down to here. Now it doesn't mean that's going to stop there, right? Sometimes we can get a flush down even more. So if it does really start to get a bit of movement on the on the downside, then probably looking at maybe sort of a maximum level would probably be this level through here, right? That that sort of yeah, that sort of that 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 point through there. So the sort of the sort of the maximum sort of pullback through there. So we could be getting that 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 there to there. Now again, look at that, right? Look what from there to there, right? From there to there is what a good 11, 12 percent, right? So that that's what we're talking about here with the Nasdaq is the good old the the hooray comes into around about that thirteen thousand level through there, right? Looking at that through there, let's look at the actual ES market as well too. Right, the ES market. The ES market is not as overextended, so we still could still could possibly get some more of a pullback through here. Um, so I would say that, yeah, just just looking at this level through here. Let's actually see where's the hooray coming. Um, the hooray. There you go, guys. I've got all kinds of sayings coming out of this market today, right? The hooray and peter out and all kinds of stuff, right? So. The, the hooray, probably the big one is that one there. And then we have a much smaller one from that one there to that one there, right? Look at that through there. So that'll be that, that'll be that level through there. So all we need probably guys is a bit of a pullback to here, right? Which goes inside from that level through there. But the reason why I say this is an incredible opportunity guys, because guess what? We could be looking for really good shorting opportunities to come down from there to there. Again, looking at the, looking at that point through there to there, from that high point down to this level through here, we're talking about a 5% pullback, possibly even more, right? Um, out of that level through there. So we're starting to see a lot of things through there, guys. And a lot of, uh, and, and there's also a lot of stocks that are starting to really like roll over big time. Uh, things like if we have a look at Microsoft, right? So Microsoft starting to roll over big time. We're starting to get this sort of, look at this massive head and shoulder formation, right? Huge shoulder, head, probably shoulder, breaking off that low. We should start to see something like that. Look at NVIDIA. Right, Nvidia is already starting to create this big, massive, false breakout to the upside. Big movement up to the upside. Look at it flattening out through here, and now we're starting to roll over. 
So there's a massive probability we're going to head back down to probably around about 380. And actually, in fact, we if we do do that, I would say probably over the next couple of weeks, NVIDIA is probably going to come down and close that gap from there. So there we go, traders. Uh, I hope this helps you out. Incredible and exciting opportunities are coming this week. Hey traders, I wanna give you free access to my Mastering the Markets trading course. Uh, if you go to johnsfreegift.com, here's what you're gonna learn in there. You're gonna learn the number one chart reading and trading technique that's working, that's been working since the 1950s. You're gonna learn the chart, the trading boundaries technique that shows you the best and worst time to place a trade. You're gonna learn also about price and time phases so you can understand what's going on right now and also what's to come as well too. My number one powerful short-term income trading system that gets a 90% success rate, the most powerful trading techniques on the planet, the biggest trading mistakes that's stopping you from making an income. You're gonna learn all about the super trader formula, plus the three secrets to making a full-time income from trading. So this is what I want you to do right now. Go to johnsfreegift.com, go there right now, get free access to this trading course. Go get the help, it's 100% free. Go there right now. Go to johnsfreegift.com right now. <laughs>